It seems like history has a habit of repeating itself. Missing person has become a new concern. Samir Khan, the name that sounds familiar in our ears. His body was found mutilated in Savo Forest in Taita three days after reported missing. Recently, the families of Abu Bakr Kalama, Khalid Salah, Juma Shante and Hassan are drenched in tears trying to solve the mystery of their beloved's whereabouts. Son of Khalid Salah tells Al Shifa TV how the anonymous people broke into their home and took his father. Kwenye wale ambao umechukuliwa ni mmoja wao ni babangu ilikuwa ni usiku wa Jumamosi kuamkia Jumapili hawa watu kuweza kuruka ukuta na wakao ni wenye kuvunja milango na kuingia ndani na kuuliza ya kwamba kuna silaha hapa zimefichwa na kufungua makabati na huku kumharas mzee na kumweka chini na kukawa kuna baadhi ya watu walijitambulisha kuwa wao ni ma police officers wataweza kuwachukua uh, mmoja wao ambao ni babangu na kuwapeleka Malindi na ikifika saa tatu watakuwa ni wenye kuregeshwa na baadhi ya maafisa ambao walikuwa wameshuka chini nyumbani kumhoji dadangu na kumuuliza ya kwamba je kuna mtu ameua mumemficha huku mtoeni na wengine wakawa ni wenye kuingia msikitini na kuvunja na kutoa zile recorder za CCTV na kuenda nazo. Na. Sasa tunaomba kwa serikali wawe ni wenye kuwaregesha hawa watu kwa sababu tunaamini kuwa hawana makosa yoyote. Na kama watakuwa wako na makosa yoyote wawe ni, weze, ni, ni wenye kupelekwa mahakamani. Yusuf Abubakar, the attorney emphasized the relevant authority to act upon the disappearance of the three men from Tundai Kilifi on 15 August 2020. Kwa sasa na nimeulizwa na familia wa wale ambao wamepotea niweze kuwakilisha kutafuta haki yao. Nimezungumza na wale ambao wameshuhudia kitendo kama hichi na sina shaka kwamba wenye kuhusika uh, ni police officers ni naomba serikali na ninaomba kitengo cha polisi kwamba nchi hii inapelekwa kwa mujibu wa katiba na kwa mujibu wa sheria kama kuna mtu yoyote ambaye wanamdhania kwamba anahusika na kitendo chochote cha kuvunja sheria sheria iko wazi unamkamata unampeleka police station unapeleka kotini unathibitisha kesi yako ili koti iweze kutoa adhabu inayostahili kama umefaulu kuthibitisha hiyo kesi na hiyo ndiyo sheria ambayo tunataka idumishwe isivunjwe lakini kulingana na trends vile mambo yanavyokwenda tumeona kesi nyingi ambapo eh, police wanashika watu na hawafuati sheria kama hiyo. Kwa hivyo tunaomba serikali According to the attorney, over 100 cases of missing person have been documented and presented to the government. Zaidi ya mia kwa sababu documented, vile visa documented. Na police na serikali inajua kwa sababu haki Afrika na mashirika mengine ya haki imeweza kupeleka uh, report kwa serikali kuhusu uh, easy uh, enforced disappearances na extrajudicial killings kwa hivyo simamo na kuwaomba na kuwasihi Honorable uh, Abdul Samad further called upon the government to intervene in the matter and uphold the safety of the common monenchi We cannot have a police force that is actually tired. Tired in the sense ya kwa wamechoka, wanaona ya kwa shortcut is just abducting people. 
And if the police is insisting ya kwa si wao, ikiwa wana insist si wao, maybe we also need to remind them the law says that anyone who has disappeared ni lazima wa to to eze kuwauliza. They are answerable to tell us how watu waliopotea. Because when uh, 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 it smells uh, like a fish, it tastes like a fish, the likelihood is that it is a fish. So, uh, it is the police. And if the police are saying that they have been framed, it is important for them to now come out clear and showcase. Like was the case when we had an Italian who was uh, uh, abducted. As much as to congratulate the police force for ensuring we want to now see a situation here to congratulate police force to where are they? And we are appealing to everyone by Kumba Atakaeweza ku kuona kokote. Maybe they might katika hali ya kuwa wanatolewa kutoka sehemu fulani kwenda sehemu nyingine for anyone ambaye kwamba atakuwa Tusimamu. The case file remained open for the missing person who vanished into thin air. The family's plea for the government to strike while the iron is hot and bring back their beloved. Dalila Hamzer, Alshifar TV, Mombasa.